The Villanova Wildcats are back home tonight following their loss to Kansas in the Final Four matchup in New Orleans. Our Wildcats have a lot to be proud of. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Roberts live on campus where the team returned a short time ago. Alicia. Hi, Joe. That's right. Despite last night, as you said, this team has so much to be proud of for what otherwise was a very successful season. But that being said, you could definitely tell last night's tough loss was top of mind, fresh for everyone who returned on campus today. CBS3 was there at Philadelphia International as the team plane touched down just after 4:30 this afternoon. It was a final flight home for players Colin Gillespie and Jermaine Samuels, who are also part of the 2018 National Championship squad. The buses. Then arrived here at Villanova about an hour later. Everyone really subdued, as you would imagine. This loss still stings quite a bit, especially for those players who know what it feels like to win it all. Under Coach Jay Wright, the Wildcats have made four Final Four appearances and won two national titles, including in 2018. This afternoon, the coach summed up how his team was feeling and expressed his gratitude to Nova Nation, who traveled to New Orleans for the Final Four last night. We also talked to Colin Gillespie. Lesby, who was emotional as the final seconds of last night's game ticked down. It's always a rough day for, for the guys. Um, you, you know, you know, you had a good season, but you're not you're not over it. You'd rather be playing, and you know, you're coming home. And last time we came home like this, it was it was after it was a Tuesday. It was it was a lot more exciting. We got the best fans in the country, and thank you, Nova Nation. Obviously, it's sad uh, being in the last game and. Uh, last time that I'll be on the, the floor with those guys and my coaches, but still just processing it all. It's, it's still kind of early, so I'll have time to kind of reflect this week and just think about everything. By the way, Colin and I both went to Archbishop Wood High School, and I know a lot of Wood fans were cheering on Colin and the entire Villanova squad last night. By the way, we had a chance to talk to Justin Moore. We saw him on his scooter. Of course, he tore his Achilles a week ago in the Elite Eight. He talked about how difficult it was to sit out last night, but what it taught him. And he says that he is prepared for next year, already thinking ahead, and that he and the rest of the team, including Coach Jay Wright, say that they have a lot to look forward to, including another possible bull run. At a championship come 2023. For now, reporting live on the campus of Villanova, Alicia Roberts, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Joe. What a class act. Alicia, thank you for that report. It's still